This lesson deals with supplemental problem 214. You can find this problem in the ECE 201 ebook in the chapter 2 supplemental problems on page 13. Suppose that I have three resistors in parallel, 18 ohms, 9 ohms, and 4 ohms, and I want to find the equivalent resistance. If you recall from the course notes that the equivalent resistance of parallel combinations is the sum of the conductances reciprocal. So I could take 1 over 18 plus 1 over 9 plus 1 over 4 and then find the result. Let's simplify the algebra by finding a common denominator. Let's try 36. So 2 times 18 is 36, 4 times 9 is 36, and 9 times 4 is 36. So if you add those together, you get 15 divided by 36, or you could write that as 36 divided by 15, and that's 2.4. Now there's also a way to do this on your calculator if you have a reciprocal button. So if you hit 18 and then 1 over, so you have 1 over 18, then we're going to add to that not 9, but the reciprocal of 9. So if you hit 9 and then 1 over, you get 1 over 9, and then that's added to the previous result. On calculators and also in programming, division and multiplication have a precedent over addition. So then if I add to that 1 quarter, in other words 4, and hit 1 over, and then equals, it'll then add 1 over 18 plus 1 over 9 plus 1 over 4, and then if I hit 1 over again, I get the reciprocal of results, and that's 2.4. This is a nice way of doing lots of resistors in parallel. You can also do the other technique we talked about in our class notes, and that there's a shortcut formula if you have only two resistors in parallel. So let's take the first two resistors, the 18 and the 9. So it'll be the product over their sum. That's 162 over 27. That turns out to be 6. And then that's in parallel with 4, which is, again, the product over the sum, which would be 24 over 10, or 2.4. And you can take them in any order you want, but just take them two at a time. This is supplemental problem 214.